Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I will be taking you through our experience with the Holiday Pet Hotel, why we have decided to do it and of course how it all went. Let's get right into it. So my boyfriend and I have decided to go on holiday. Somewhere warm and sunny to lay on the beach and swim in the pool. However, we knew that this type of holiday, or actually any type of holiday, is not something that our bird would prefer. We have previously taken our green chikonia parrot Elvis on holiday with us. Both times he did not have a good time and made sure to let us know about it. You can watch my video on our previous vacations with our parrot linked in the top right corner. And so we knew that we had to go without our bird. The question was what to do with the bird? We had no family members, no friends who could drop by to feed him and play with him for a few hours a day. We had no friends or family members who we could take him to that we would be comfortable with. And so we decided we will take our parrot to the Holiday Pet Hotel. The most important thing we wanted to make sure of is that our bird is happy while we are away. Banana? To ensure that, we chose a place where we thought the birds were happy and playing as they wished. We chose a place that was also able to give a bit of more attention to him, play with him and watch him. We also knew what we did not want. We did not want a place where we thought that the birds were never getting out of the cage, nor a place where the birds had no toys in their cages. We wanted a pet hotel that felt happy, with playful birds jumping all over and joyful parrot sounds. To find such a holiday pet hotel, we reached out to the pet store where we purchased our parakeet from. Their recommendation in the end became our final choice. On the big day, we took our Conyer by car to the hotel. We packed his travel cage with plenty of toys and of course got ready with his snacks and his food and off we were. He's usually fine in the car. We cover the travel cage so he stays calm during the trip. Once we arrived at the destination, the first thing we heard from the front yard were the happy bird sounds playing and flying around. The moment we entered the room, we had conures and other parakeets flying to us and playing on our shoulders. We instantly got a good feeling about the place and we knew we made the right choice for our parrot's holiday destination. The other birds got curious about Elvis. They started jumping on his cage and getting a close look. Elvis, on the other hand, could not comprehend what was going on. It was a bit too much happening for him. Still, he was on his front perch in the cage, watching everyone closely. We were advised that it is best to keep him in the cage for the first day, so he gets used to his new environment. The following day, he would be let out of the cage to interact more with other birds and fly around. While on holidays, we kept close contact with the hotel and were getting the latest updates on our bird. We also received some short videos of him playing. All of that assured us once again of the right choice of holiday pet hotel. When our holidays were over and the time came to pick up our bird, and we went to the hotel to pick him up, he was out of the cage playing with one of the ladies from the hotel. He also happily came to us and stood on our shoulders while we greeted him. I'm not sure whether at that point he has recognized us or not. He was just happy to play with any of the humans around him. On the other hand, we were told that he has not interacted much with the other birds there, even though the majority of them were green chikonyers, just like him. I think our Elvis is a people bird and not as much a bird's bird. That could also be because he has been interacting with humans only since we got him at 11 weeks old, up until almost 2 years old. Once home though, the first thing our bird did was jump on his big cage and start hopping from one spot to the other. 
We could tell that Elvis was happy to be home. His reaction was exactly what we had expected. He loves being home above anything, regardless where we take him. There were a few things that we have noticed in the first days we got our Elvis back. The most obvious was he was hungry. He was eating everything, be it seeds, pellets, or fruit and veggies. He would eat it all without even breathing. Second thing we noticed, he did not receive his dose of cuddles. Therefore, he would be extra cuddly with us the first few days. The third thing we noticed... Elvis did not smell like Elvis. And lastly, our baby was very tired. We knew that our bird gets stressed in new environments. Because of that, he eats much less, he sleeps worse, and so is more tired than usual. We have recognized all of the consequences except for one, the new smell. Even after three baths, our parrot would still not smell like himself. He would just smell differently. After royal meals, for a few days in a row and a few good nights sleep, our green chick has finally started behaving like himself. We are now reunited with our bird and feeling rested after having had a great holiday ourselves. In hindsight, we consider our experience with the Parrot Hotel to be a success because of the following. Firstly, the place had a limited number of birds and therefore Elvis had sufficient attention and care. Secondly, our bird was let out of the cage and has interacted with other humans. Thirdly, he received fruit and veggies apart from seeds. And finally, he has learned to adapt in a new environment without his mommy and daddy. It is also very likely that our parrot will return to the same parrot hotel when we decide to go on holiday again. He got much more human attention and interaction with other birds compared to how much we could have offered him had we taken him with us on holiday. This was our experience with the parrot hotel. I am happy and I'm curious to hear your feedback. Let me and Elvis know in the comments below. We are happy to read and reply to all of them. In the meantime, take care and have a fluffy and happy day further. Bye!